For 12 years, Errol Keller has been talking to people about prostate cancer. After getting the all clear from an aggressive form of the disease, he's campaigned at the garage he runs and through his foundation to persuade men to get tested, something he knows a bit about. Every year, somebody brings their car for me to service an MOT. This is the attitude that we need to have with our bodies. If you don't check your motor car and you drive it and the brakes fail, you're in trouble, right? And it's the same with your body. And, you know, these new tests and these new things that are happening with prostate cancer is a massive game changer. Could the MRI be the new MOT for the prostate? Latest research finds MRI scans were significantly better than the current PSA blood test used to spot the cancer early. The UK has a prostate cancer death rate that's significantly higher than other countries such as France, Italy, Spain. So we need to do something to address that. And we know that the blood test on its own isn't as accurate as we need it to be. So this is a way forward to help us with a refined prostate cancer screening approach. A much larger study is needed to prove MRI prostate screening is clinically and cost effective, but it offers important hope. We know that over 52,000 men are diagnosed with prostate cancer in the UK each year, and sadly of those, over 10,000 are diagnosed um, too late when it's already spread. So if we could you have an effective screening programme and potentially utilise uh, MRI imaging, for example, um, to detect those cancers early, it could have such a huge impact on those men. A national screening programme would save many lives, but more men need to come forward for testing, say experts, particularly those of black ethnicity or anyone with a family history of prostate cancer. Tom Clark, Sky News.